A sea turtle found stranded in the Gulf of Mexico now has a chance to get back to open seas, all thanks to three local college students. The seniors at WPI created a prosthetic fin for the turtle as part of a final project. Our Cam Jandro introduces us to Lola the turtle. With the help of three college students, one sea turtle's decade-long struggle comes to an end. This is actually kind of sad to watch because these turtles out in the ocean swim freely and, and they have the ability to, to move so gracefully. She didn't. Lola is a Kemp's Ridley sea turtle who lost one of her flippers back in 2002. As part of their major qualifying project, WPI students Eok Wong, Samantha Varela, and Vivian Liang partnered with the Key West Aquarium to create a lifelike flipper for Lola. Greg Gerwin is a curator at the Key West Aquarium and says these students changed Lola's life. With this prosthetic uh, flipper that's going to be pretty much fitted on her stub, may just give her that ability to swim straight, be able to swim more comfortably. The prosthetic flipper is the first of its kind in the world and was created by a 3D printer. Dr. Doug Mater is a veterinarian at the aquarium and says the new limb will benefit Lola and turtles alike. Not uncommon to see animals come in with two flippers missing, and unfortunately those animals are euthanized. Well, Lola's been a willing participant, and with the help of the technology at WPI, we've come up with a new flipper design that will allow her to have a normal life. Now, Dr. Mater says flipper injuries are the most common injuries for sea turtles, and with this new technology, it should decrease the amount of turtles euthanized along with keep the species from going extinct. As for Lola, she's wearing her new fin and swimming as if nothing had ever happened. Olivia? What a great story. Thank you.